All right, everybody. Just a quick one on these uh, folding saws that people, few people have got. Uh, folding ball saws. Here's the blades that come with it. See the way they're finished off like that? They've got a little lug. As your normal blades wouldn't come like that, they'll come with two holes or a hole. Right? So these ones that you take apart, yeah, the metal one. I'll show you the uh, I'll show you a little trick I've come up with. This bottom one here, that's the blade that you get. Like I say, comes with that little lug in the hole. And the blades that you buy, spare blades, will come with two holes in. Let me just take that pin out for you. See that there? And you come with two holes, no pin. Right? But what you can do is See these little split pins? Take the tape measure here, look. Can you move that out? It's a one inch split pin. Right? So relatively small. And, uh, see the way I've done that? I've got it through that last hole, got it skew with. And if I do the other one, one second. I've done that at the other end, but I've put it in the nearer hole. It doesn't really matter that it... And these holes here, these blades that fit in both holes. You just see the way I've gone th just through the top lip of the hole? So I've got the pin going through the top bit. See that there? Right, one second. And the saw just... There's a bit of a slot on that side. Another little slot in there. The blade just slots in. Like so. And then you tension by screwing your two knobs or your knobs at the end. And uh, that is perfectly serviceable. Okay. So, spare blades that you're looking for. This particular one is a backhoe. Can you make that out in there? 15 inch, 378 mil. That's the one I've got. Uh, that's that blade there, the spare blade, because they come with those blades. So just a little tip, because they're easier than putting nuts and bolts in. Nut and bolts are two part bit. That's just one. You know. So they work. As it happens, you could use a little key link. I do it with that, no, they work. It's just a different kind there. See what I'm saying? Just click it on the hole, and there, uh, that gives it enough. Same as that. Just click it into the hole. Just a little there. Uh, you might find that useful. Instead of coming on a two part nut and bolt, just use a little split pin. Or keyring, loop, clip, but I'll do that on quite a few saws. The ones that you can get the blade right through the back, that idea works even better. But it works perfectly well in there, I mean perfectly well. So you can get replacement blades for that saw. And that's what you're looking for. 15 inch, 378mm Bosch. And, uh, or Baco, sorry, Baco, not Bosch, Baco, and they work perfectly well. Okay, just a quick one. Little split rings, spare blade, or a key ring thing in your Bushcrafty telescopic fold-up bow saw.